Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to palm a basketball. Now for some reason, this video is so highly requested and today I'm going to show you how to palm a 29.5 basketball, but I also have a women's basketball. This is a 28.5, this is a 29.5. I lost my Spalding NBA official basketball. I don't know where it's at. So unfortunately I don't have that basketball for this video, but there is a video of me on Instagram palming an official NBA ball, even though like they're the same size, but there's a video of that on Instagram. So you can check that out if you like don't believe me. But anyways, just to start, I am 5'8". I'm obviously a female. This is about how big my hands are. I don't like, I don't know if you can see in like relation to my face, but I have pretty long fingers, but not the biggest like, I guess like palm size and people are normally really impressed when they see me palm a basketball. So hopefully I can give you guys some tips so that you can do it as well. I'll start by just showing you like it's very easy for me to palm a women's basketball and you can see like, you know, this is 28, this is 29. Uh, so yeah, but enough with that. We'll move on to the guys basketball. The first tip that I have for you is put your fingers in the grooves of the basketball. So anywhere on here, you don't want to put it like where all of these like lines come together. If you just put it kind of on the flat part right here and make sure that you get, I like to get my third, fourth and pinky finger in the grooves and then also make sure that your thumb is in the groove. Another thing before you start, make sure that your hands are clean. Like you don't want to have sweaty hands or you just like put lotion on your hands. And another thing before you start attempting to palm a basketball, you want to make sure that you're warmed up. So sometimes right when I step on a court and I'm like not warmed up, I can't palm a basketball. Like my hands just need to be warmed up and just like any other muscle group in your body. Your hands and your forearms are the muscles that you need to palm a basketball. So basically all you want to do is get your hand as wide as you can but make sure that your fingertips are like really deep into those grooves and you, you're just gonna grab it. <laughs> like I don't know how much more I can tell you guys besides make sure that you're strengthening your hands, make sure that you're doing things to I guess strengthen your forearms but in the end I just one day was able to palm a basketball and I think all it comes down to is just always having a basketball in your hand and you know doing drills like this I actually did a video where you can improve your handles without dribbling the basketball if you do some of those drills then that'll really like get your hand strength better and get your forearm strength better and then if you're just if you just always have a basketball in your hand, you're always practicing and you're always practicing palming it, then one day I think that you will be able to as well. You don't need to have like super big hands. You don't need to, you know, be super strong. I mean, my arms are like pretty skinny, <laughs> but it, you know, that's all I got. So um, hopefully that helps. All right guys, so that's all for this video. Make sure that you give it a thumbs up if it was at all helpful or possibly entertaining, I don't know. And I'll see you guys next time.